I work at Thomas Clarkson Academy as a subject lead for biology and head of social sciences. I think it's really important for teachers to carry on developing beyond their initial teacher training. And so after I've done my initial teacher training, there's been a year or two where I've not really done any, um, any professional course. And I think it's really important to have access to a development that is much more tailored. Um, and the blanket CPD that we can offer as a school is not always necessarily helping everyone improve in the best way because it is addressed to everyone rather than tailored to the individual. Um, so I wanted to do the Chartered Teacher um, programme to um, help me improve in my teaching, especially as I move towards the middle leadership roles. I wanted to make sure that I'm still continuing on working on my day-to-day -day teaching practice and having that accreditation from the professional body. I really enjoyed um, that I could tailor this um, pathway to my own experiences. So for example, one of the modules I did on biology teaching and the other one on sociology teaching. So I could um, really tailor it to my roles uh, within the school. Um, I also really enjoyed working with my colleagues throughout this project. We did it all together as a, as a group. Uh, and that was really helpful to have that supportive and collaborative environment working with colleagues from across different departments within the school. So we've been meeting regularly about once a month, maybe once every two months in a group of four or five people uh, and it's been really helpful to work towards the same project and the same accreditation uh, but if we're, with everyone focusing on different part of their teaching um, and it was really nice to kind of learn more from colleagues from different departments. So working, for example, with colleagues from English and photography, um, myself in science. It was nice to compare how we are ultimately all teachers, but actually focusing on different aspects. Um, it helped us develop from one another as well. I really enjoyed the flexibility of uh, this uh, Chartered Teacher Pathway in the way that I could tailor the projects to what I was currently working on in the classroom and the aspects of my practice that I wanted to improve rather than doing something that's completely unrelated. And I enjoyed the mixture of self-based uh, learning uh, through the online resources and having the opportunity to meet regularly with my colleagues uh, going through the same process as me. I really enjoyed working on the Education Research Inquiry Certificate um, because it allowed me to do my own little research project. Um, I worked on uh, the transition between uh, Year 11 and sixth form in Biology A level and how can we bridge the gap um, for students and I really enjoyed um, doing something that directly links to my teaching practice and having an opportunity to uh, both read around the subject and uh, engage with the academic literature uh, but then also collect my own results in a probably more robust way than just reflecting on my own teaching practice. I think it's um, really useful and really important that um, this um, career development comes with the accreditation from the professional body of Chartered College of Teaching. Um, and as such, this is a valuable thing because it then uh, provides an accreditation that is recognised across the profession. Um, so if I was to change schools or move on with my career, um, this is something that I would definitely be referring to on my CV. I'm actually moving on to a new role in September as Head of Science and it is definitely something that I've also mentioned on my interview um, and I think it played a part in me getting the role. Having uh, the Chartered Teacher status uh, is something that is becoming more and more recognised across the profession and it highlights the importance of a continual professional development beyond initial training um, and the importance of tailoring that development to your current career stage and an opportunity to engage with academic research and making sure that we use that in everyday practice.
I think for me the biggest um, learning is just highlighting the importance of continual reflection on your everyday practice. I like to think I'm quite a good teacher but everyone can improve and I think for me personally especially as I'm moving on to a more um, middle leadership role it's uh, really important not to lose track of the biggest part of my job which is teaching and impacting the students in my classroom uh, and making sure I reflect on that and try to um, improve and deliver the best performance possible. I think it's a great opportunity um, to uh, gain a uh, professional accreditation. Um, it does require commitment, but it is also something that is very manageable um, because it's spread over a couple of years. Uh, and it is something that allows you to progress with your career and develop your practice further.